Oya, Oya, Hara, Hara. Oh God, that feels so fucking good. Now I'm gonna stuff my fucking face with Pepperidge Fam. What's up, YouTube? This is the Mermail Master coming at you from the Team Time Riders Yugi Tube channel with the first in a series of combo videos. Now, this is a deck that I have profiled already, and it is none other than Metal Foes Yang Zing. Now, I'm gonna take you through some of the combos in this deck. And you're going to see just how strong this deck is because this deck is going to be very, very fun. A lot of people be trying to pick up all of these cards and be trying to build this deck because of the fact that it's going to be very good with the release of Deng Long and with the release of um, the Nine Branches of the Yang Zing Trap card. But before then, you know, uh, you got to do a little bit of MacGyvering and get some of the stuff that you need for the deck. So without further ado, let's just get into some of the combo video right now. So, to start off, um, I will mention that the Metal Foes deck is very, um, like the Yangzi Metal Foes is a very, very uh, kind of inconsistent deck, but that doesn't stop it from being good. So, like, you know, figure starting off with a hand of, like, five cards, right? So, you know, this is an average hand in a Yangzi deck. And usually, what you wanted to do with Yangzi was you always wanted to open up Jiao Tu, be able to summon Jiao Tu, um, you know, ditch your two Yangzings, do your you know, effects and stuff like that. However, you know, this is not really how it works in this current point in time. And I'll show you why. And that's because you have the Metal Foes. Now, the main thing about the Metal Foes is that they can help you to proactively pop the cards on your side of the field. So, you know, you don't have Yang Zings as a deck trying not to get killed, which is sort of what they usually were. You know, keep re recycling your stuff and like missing a ton of timing. But now instead of trying to not trying trying not to get killed, you know they can proactively make some moves and uh, make some interesting plays and stuff like that. So I guess to start off, um, I will say you know like we don't like this deck does not sort of have the ability to like do like specific types of stuff, but it still has a good amount of ability. Um, like it, it can be stopped by Maxi and it can be stopped by Effect Veiler and you know that that kind of sucks, but uh, still. It's okay, so getting into the first combo right now, uh, rather than doing that, you, you, you're going to want a normal summon if you have like uh, any one of your like, you know, multiple uh, Yang Zing monsters, like a Suani or like a Pulau or something like that. You know, you're going to want to put them on a field like that. You're going to want to tribute it off for your Metal Folk card. And that is going to, uh, let me move this off to the side here. What that's going to do is that's going to allow you to set something called like this Metal Folk combination. It's going to allow you to set that to your spell and trap card zone. And then it's going to allow you to special summon your metal, uh, your uh, monster from your deck. And that monster is going to be your Jiao Tu. Now, Jiao Tu is going to activate his effect. Um, select two card in your hand and discard them. Any two Yang Zing. So it could be a monster. It could be two monsters, two spell or trap. Discard them to the graveyard. Like so. Um, you know, if you got, if you open up with a Chi Wen, that's like an extra, extra good thing. And that's going to allow you to fetch one, uh, one attack position and one defense position monsters from your field. So let's fetch like one copy of Beyond and one copy of your Zephron Yu. And Zephron Yu is the most important card. Like you run him at three in the deck for a reason. And that's because he allows you to make many of your key plays in the deck. So first, you can synchro them off. Synchro with the Jiao Tu and Zephron Yu goes back to your Pendulum Zone to Special Summon Baxia Brightness at a Yang Zing. Now, I didn't realize just how good this card is. You can use this card for a variety of reasons. But yeah, you summon with Baxia Brightness at a Yang Zing. Now, what most people do is most people have the opportunity to really go for, you know, you're going to pop the face down Metal Foes combination to search something. However, I want to go a little bit further, and instead of popping the face down Metal Foes combination, I want to pop this thing right here. You know, your other Yang Zing monster. And you pop that, and then its ability will allow you to re-special summon Jiao Tu from the graveyard due to the effect. And since you popped a, uh, a Beyond whose effect hadn't activated before, what it's going to allow you to do is allow you to summon that second Zephranu from the deck. Special summon that to the field. You're able to synchro summon again. Special summoning fourth another Baxia. You know, bounce more cards if you want to bounce more cards. And this time you're going to take this and you're going to pop it. And the Metal Foes combination searches you whatever scales you're going to need. 
let's see here. So we got stealing on the seal the field right now. We go fetch the uh, silvered and put that on the other scale. And now, what you got is you're able to uh, use the uh, the effects and stuff again of those monsters, and you a special summon something f to the field. Like it depends on what you want to summon. Like for instance, you could special summon like uh, one of the monsters you didn't know use before. You special summon that she went back to the field. Uh, that allows you to go for specific other play and stuff. And then you activate the pendulum scale effect. Special summon both these dudes back. Activate the effect. And this time, you're going to be fetching that card known as Zephyr Divine Strike. Dick card? That's a really good card, man. That's a really good card. I'm telling you. Zephyr Divine Strike. Very, very good card. And look at that right now. You got this stuff right here. And now, what you can do is you can use the effect of the Metaphose Silver, which is in your other Pendulum Scale. Let me just move this shit over here. You can use that effect in your other Pendulum Scale. You know, you pop one of these things. Like, you know, you pop that Chiwen or something like that. This shit gonna go to the graveyard. A special summon out your, uh... Your spe freaking special summon out, uh... Zephrasi Treasure to Yang Zing. It's a frassy treasure, treasure of the Yang Zing. You know, you could, you could make like, uh, you, know, you could use this uh, trigger, trigger this thing right over here, synchro both of these to make like, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like right now, you know, pushing forward for that Ultimaya Tsoken. That's a very good card right there. You summon that thing in defense mode. You know, your opponent ain't gonna do nothing. You know, you got that stuff on the field. You could go for like a rank six or some shit like that, or, you know, you could fucking set that shit and summon out like a big ass dragon. But that's not what we're going to do right now. Because while you can do that play, you know, there's other good plays that you can make. Now, a lot of people like make Har Hope Harbinger Dragon. But I think that there's different play you can make right now. You know, you could fucking uh, trigger this guy. Synchro both of these fools together since you activated this dude, dude's effect. You know, shuffle him back into the bottom of the deck. You know what I'm saying right now? Special summon forth. You know how, you know how it is right now? Chow Feng, Phantom of the Yang Zing. Big, big dude. Big, beefy dude. Very, very good card. Overlay this guy off. You know what I'm saying? Special summon. Divine Dragon Knight Felgrim. And look at that feel right there. You know, you got that extra deck stuff. And then all you got to do is you got to set that path and you got to set that Divine Strike. In. Bada bing, bada boom. You got a field. Because that's, that's how you, that's how you got to do it, man. That's, you know, that's how you got to do it. That's how you got to do it. You know, this is a combo, combo moves and, you know, all that kind of good stuff right there, man. You know, making, making big combo with your Yang Zing. And that's, uh, that's, uh, you know, uh, popping, popping all your dude and, you know, making all your play and all that good stuff. And yeah, man. So yeah. Look at that. Very, very good. Very, very good. Very, very good. Freaking Yang Zing, all together. Metal Fo Yang Zing. It's gonna be a very good deck this format. So see you guys later, and peace out.